Hello guys, now today we are talking about how to access a file through SSH in Hostinger. So first we are logging a Hostinger account. So click a login and uh, I am logging with the my Google account so login your account according to you click on the website and uh, click on the manage button and then click on the advance and click on the SSH access so you can see here my SSH status is active so if you are inactive your SSH status then first you are the activate your SSH so click here the active and then you can see here uh, SSH detail your IP address and port number and user number and password if you not set your password then first set up your password and then log in to SSH so you can see here use the build in the terminal your device open the terminal and paste the this text into the command line you will be the requested to enter your SSH password so you can see here your SSH and hyphen P is the flag port number and username and your IP address so here you can see add SSH key if you are the generating a SSH public key then you input uh, add SSH key button and enter the your SSH key without entering your password you can access your files without input any password every file encrypted with the your public key so first I copy with the this credential this command and using a any terminal you can input this command in any terminal like a git bash cmd and powershell based so now you can see here without entering a password my successfully login my hosting account now using a ls list command you can see a public.html file now change the directory of public.html so using a ls command so every file and folders which are found in a public.html so if you want to open a any folder so using a cat command now you can see Using the cat command, you know what are in files, what text are in files. Again, if you want to open another file, so using cat map.css uh, files. So you can see a CSS file are opening in a git bash terminal. So this is the secure sale uh, data transfer into your local computer if you want to change delete update using a secure cell then you learn a Linux command and working with them it is the secure we are talking about how to SSH secure cell or transfer data between a server and local computer to the putty client so here is the host name and now enter your port number now click on the open so login is input your user and password you will type password access denied So now you can see my Hostinger account is successfully login. You are the using a Linux command change in any file and folders. You create uh, any files and folders and change data, copy data, anything you want to change using the Linux command. So I take some couple of examples. 
ls now we see here the public html file now change the directory now you can see my if3 files are showing here so first i show you in files now using the cat command now you can see what our data into a file in the files if you want to create a files then using a touch command cmom.txt cmom.txt files are successfully created now let's check it's created or not so using the ls command uh, now you can see here cmom.txt files are successfully created if you want to remove these files then what you can do so rm remove file cmom.txt now cmom.txt are successfully removed let's check it's removed or not so ls so you can see here is cmom.txt file but not showing here it means cmom.txt file are successfully removed you can do everything uh, using the linux command change update or any data value to a secured cell using the putty client so now we are the logout using the exit command